Hello, everybody. Welcome to the coolest podcast ever. Sometimes episode. something. Episode. Yeah. 49. No, I told you 10 minutes ago oh. what the episode number was. You asked. 40. It's not 50. 48. Not 48. Episode 48. Yep. Okay. Welcome to episode 48. It's just going to be me and Cade because yep. those other guys um, both died in a tragic accident involving beanie babies and 43 gallons of lube. Mm hmm. Um, can... but we'll, next podcast we'll we'll go over that we'll go over the autopsies um, yeah we're still waiting and we'll, we're, we're, we're also going to the next podcast going to be sponsored by the loop company um uh, yeah, they want to support be... us they were uh... yeah yeah as long as we do a breakdown and show give a demonstration on how you can drown in lube uh you know yep so kevin's working on the reenactment we'll have a video yep. prepared yeah i'm gonna drown in a tub of lube next week yeah um so stay tuned for yeah. that yeah, that'll be exciting. Yeah, um, and we'll we'll have two new hosts next week as well. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, so Fred Armiston and uh, Jeffrey Bezos will be hosting, mm -hmm. uh, which is a bit of a wombo combo, if you ask me. I don't know yeah. who Fred Armiston is. He's the comedian. <laughs> he's a he's in he was in Philadelphia. He usually does. Oh, okay, kind of I know roles. who he is. <laughs> I yeah. just like absolutely sent it on a name. I was like, yeah. Fred Armiston. <laughs> He did a he did a comedy special where he did like comedy and played like the drums and like different like Oh yeah, right. It was really fun, yeah. I like that. Anyways, I, I fucking think I saw <laughs> clips of that. Anyways, yeah. today we got a fun special uh, a fun podcast because we're gonna play two two roost one lie. Um but specifically today we're gonna do it with lore from different or at least I'm doing it with lore. I'm not too 100% yeah. sure what Cade's doing it with. Yeah, doing just, it with? Uh, some are lore, some are just kind of like video game facts that I think cool. you might know. There's one There's one that I there's a, you'll probably know, but I don't know if you'll... I hope I came up with one that's good enough. Well, you, you can always know. change them a little bit, right? So it's yeah. like, I know Nintendo did that, but I don't know if they did it with that game or... Yeah. I didn't just do like years of things like this game came out in 1987. So, oh, oh, yeah, actually but I'm sure you'll have some tricks because I know, I know yeah, you'll yeah. be like, yeah, I don't trust it. Um, yeah, yeah. You have a, um, I, I have a 40k one and then a Lord of the Rings one. Oh boy, um, and yeah, they're both things. goofy. They're All both right. goofy. What do you, how do you think you're going to do? Uh, the okay, here's what I'll say about the 40k one because I know you don't really know 40k. If you knew 40k, you would have the equal chance. Like you would. There's so much like fucking obscure. more, and this is so obscure. Um, I I don't know if you would have much of a chance. Right. Uh, oh, one of them you would know because it's. Um, yeah, I guess one of them you would know if it's true or false. Maybe. But maybe. Uh, maybe. Yeah, even the Lord of the Rings one, I. I've seen those movies. I, I haven't seen those movies in like ten years. Oh, oh, okay. I like how you said the movies and not referencing the books because no, I was I've, like, I've, I've read if the somebody's Hobbit. read the books, I was sitting there going, if somebody's read the books six or seven times, mm -hmm. I need to get. That's what I was kind of. That's what I've done. So these ones, I yeah. kind of tried to pick ones that would probably fool me. Yeah. Um, and I'm a. I'm not a huge Lord of the Rings nut, but I've watched like a lot of lore videos on it. I mean, I've read the books at least five or six times. Mm. Um, mm. but you know, when I was a bit younger. Yeah, I have um, read The Hobbit in grade six, but that's it. I haven't read it since. So um, that's my Lord of the Rings. Knowledge. Would you have a chance? You've seen the movies. Yeah, uh, I mean, yeah. We'll You'll see be fine. There's always You'll a chance. Be fine. There's a, what, You'll be fine. 33% chance that I get it right? Um, you're the math yeah, guy. yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But if, you, if you're, yeah, you get to get one of them yeah each one is a 33 percent chance now to get one of them right instead of both it's higher but i don't know how to do the math on that. oh right because two yeah. like because it's 33 oh okay and that's math that's math boring nobody's here for math <laughs> but I, get <laughs> I, think, what you're I think it's 30 because there's two wrong. 33 um anyways um yeah. do you want to go first sure okay i really want to know what yours are yeah i feel you... like yours are mine are kind of heavy so like I'll give you the option. Do you want do you want a Sonic one, a Mario one, a Control one, a Mass oh Effect God. one, or an Elden Ring one? Oh, are you just going to make me say true or false on each one of these? Oh my God! Okay. No, no, they all have three options. Where I'm going to list you like. Oh, they all have three. Oh my yeah. God! Okay, I didn't do this many. I did like three. My mine are very simple. Like okay, okay. Um, say those again. All right, Elden Ring. Mass Effect. Let's do Elden Ring. Let's Elden start with Ring. Elden Ring. Right. That's, a, that's a banger to start with. 
All right, so I got okay. Go for it. Three facts about Ronnie. You know Ronnie, right? The witch, the yeah, witch the, doll the, lady. the mom, the hot mommy witch. Yes, yeah, that's the one. Yep. All right, so I'm yeah. gonna, I'm gonna just read three facts, and you tell me which one is not true. You, Ron- uh, I was gonna say, remember which ones you've read and exactly what you say because I don't want to catch you in like a accidental slip up. Okay, go for it. Go mm, for it. Okay, okay. Ronnie was an Empyrean. Ronnie had a mentor, which was a snowy crone known as the Snow Witch, and she had two older brothers, Radon and Moog. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> oh, I'm going to get caught by Radon and Moog because there's going to be a third one that I fucking don't know about. Radon? Mm. Who the fuck's Radon? I'm blanking so hard right now. Big that uh, we just fought him, the big guy. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. That's Redon. What's, what's this full title, Redon? Uh, anyway, a scourge. So Redon, star scourge, Redon, or whatever. Because the other one, I think. Wait, how many seats are in the Godfrey? There's, <laughs> there's. Fuck, that might be true because I think there's the other guy who's like the shithead you fight at the first castle. Um, you know, like the first boss that everyone fights. The, what's his face? Uh, the gun. Oh, there's the grafted, and then there's the dude with the staff. You know what I'm talking about? Like the first one. Yeah, yeah, the guy that jumps but off the tower. The... Shit. Mm-hmm. Because the guy that jumps off the tower, like the first like boss that everyone runs into, he's younger. Because mm. I, I think, yeah, he's like the youngest run, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna be. This is gonna. Look, I'm gonna look like such a jackass if I'm like literally getting. <laughs> Are you this googling one. things? But <laughs> I see you over there looking at your your side screen. No, I've written all three of them down, so I can. Oh, I like, see. I see. Yeah, I've written like Imperian. I know Imperian's true, so you're fucked. Hmm. Um, I don't know anything about the second one. The Snow Witch. I mean, that sound like she's icy. Like that would make sense. Mm-hmm. I feel like the only one I can kind of think about is the older brothers. That's why I'm focusing on it. Because Empyrean, I know that's true. Right. Or at least she was. What was it again? She is an Empyrean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. She's like one of the reasons you can win. The, she can become, right, so she, so she, her mom. Mom's a snow witch. I don't know a huge amount about Ronnie, other than... Like general family lore. Nice. Okay, I picked a good uh, character. Though. Yeah, that was. Yeah, yeah. I wanted yeah. to pick a popular one. I know she one, like. But... There's some other facts you could have gone for that I would like. I knew she like murdered people. Uh, she she is in charge of all the assassins. I think. Uh, um, something like that. Twin older brother. Two older brothers. Mm-hmm. She has two older brothers. That's what you're saying. Um. Because I think the grafted God Godric. What did you say? Uh, did I you said say? she has two older brothers, Radon and Moog. Um, and Moog. The problem is, I remember God, God, Godric the Grafted? Whatever the fuck the Grafted guy is. That right. puts the second big boss, puts the dragon on his own. Right, right, right. I think that's her older brother. Hmm. I'm going to go with the two brothers is a lie. That is a lie. Yes. But you're still... Yes. Radon oh, no. is her older brother, but Moog is Moog. not. Oh, I got it wrong. Oh, of course Moog's not. I'm a dumbass because oh, yeah. Moog's... Um... Is, she only... is Radon her only older brother? Nope. She has two, but the the second one was uh, Rykard. Uh, yeah, I got the finally levels mixed up. I think the right. ones I'm thinking of are just like there's a few. There's would like, be her nephew uh, or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 Of it's course it's right. Yeah. Of course. Of course it's not Godric. He's not. He doesn't have his own like. I knew that too. Mm-hmm. Whatever. Okay. I got. I got lucky. I got lucky. I mean, the yeah, other yeah. ones I knew: Imperian and Snow Witch. I had no chance. Okay. Yeah, that one I. I, I, I that turned into a fifty-fifty, and I got lucky with. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Very good. Very good. You got it. Yeah, of course, because Radon is like a huge big deal. Godric the Grafted and the other guy isn't. Neither of them are big deals. I mean, they're you know. Oh, I guess what's his face guards like the throne. I was trying to think the throne room that you fight. Um, what's his face in, or like the before oh. you run up and fight. You know what I mean? Because there's the, the top. all the seats. Isn't yeah. that Godfrey? Again? I think there's. Sorry. Isn't that Godfrey? Like a. Yeah, it is. 
Well, there's Godric and Godfrey. Yeah, it's the second oh, Godfrey right. fight where he yeah. transforms into like the warrior king or whatever. And he's got his lion um, thing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, you got it. You got it. I got it. I'll take it. Very good. Very good. Okay. Do you want the Lord of the Rings or the 40k one? I'm going to have so much trouble with this. All right. Give me. Give me so the there's the three for each one, and you have to tell me which one's in. Well, yeah, it's the same format that you just did. Yep, except yep. they're way more. <laughs> okay. God, which one do you want? Uh, give me the, the Lord of the Rings. Okay. The Lord of the Ring ones. Okay, this one's easier. Okay. This one's easier. The other okay. one is the heavy one. Maybe we'll end with that or something. Okay. Um, okay. So, uh, these are... Shit. I didn't really think about this. Okay, fine. Um, Sauron, the big mm -hmm. the big baddie, yep. Um, yep. was originally a cat in the earlier versions of the story um, okay. because Tolkien doesn't like cats and it's the reason that in the books the elves don't like cats either because okay. uh, Tolkien was like low-key self-inserting with the elves. Okay. Um, speaking of self-inserting, the elves celebrate conception, is the nice way to put it, instead of a birthday. Okay. So they celebrate the day. So you got to be like mom, dad. When did you bang? Let's right. celebrate. Right. 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 Okay. Because that's nice and not awkward. Yeah. Um, and then this one, this one's a bit more intent involved. Um, orcs. So you know, there's orcs. Like think yeah. you know, or like specifically orc guy. Like you know the, you know the uh, guys in uh, Saruman's army that they pull out of those pits in the right, movies, yeah, you know, like the, the big ones, the big right, fuckers right, right. with the white hands on their faces. Yeah. Those guys are children of elf and goblins. So uh, the idea is there's big, you get, you take big, mature, fat goblin women okay. um, and you impregnate them with elfish sperm. Now, elves aren't cool with this. So you can't like be like, hey, elves, you want to come hang out with the goblins? It doesn't work. Um, so elves' bodies don't decompose oh. <laughs> uh, because, just as a general rule, because elves, when they age, it's actually, they don't get old. It's just their soul slowly leaving their body. And that's why they also have to leave for that other land, is because in the other land, it's where souls can just exist by themselves. So the bodies always eventually decompose on elves. Um, it's because their souls, like, technically eating them. But, like, they stay as, a, like, a, you know, ethereal being. Uh, okay. When they fuck off to that new manure, I can't remember what it's called. You know, like where Bill goes at the end of the. I think so. You know, when they all leave at the very end of the movies when they're all like crying and they get on a ship and fuck off. Yeah. That's where they're yes. going. Um, okay. So, since they, their bodies never decompose, the only thing that can make them decompose is like something else that resembles a spirit eating them. So the body just stays there, vertical and full of sperm. Oh, no. So. If you remember in the third movie when they're crossing the swamps, or is it the second uh -huh. movie? No, it's the third movie. No, it's the second movie. Second or third movie? I think it's the third movie. When they're crossing, crossing the swamps with Gollum to get to Mordor. Okay. And they like he's like stepping in muck and it's all gross and stuff. And he steps in, there's like a dead body in there that's like preserved. It's it's because it that was the area, that section between where they were going through was the area that um they did like the okay you remember the beginning of the movies when oh, there's boy. the really big fight that shit from like a thousand years ago oh, or whatever yeah, yeah, and yeah. sarang gets his like hand chopped yep. off and stuff so that battlefield is that swamp gotcha. right so there's a fuckload of dead elves there mm. that are just laying and decomposing or not to be composing. Right, right, right. So the so uh, uh goblins go get elves from there and they get their sperm, and then they stab one of the fat elf women. So they stab the fat elf women, and then they push them into like a hole full of like, that like eats their bodies like acid kind of, but it's like got other growth and they put other meat in it. Um, <laughs> and then after a little while, like a short, a short time, because it's good at making armies, uh, an orc is born. Um, and the orcs, the size of the orc is based on how big the mom is, um and and some of the strength is based on how like fancy the elf was so if you got like a big a fancy elf knight you got a good orc right so that's why they weren't all just op as fuck right so that's where orcs are from uh oh yeah that was the third oh, one that was okay that so was three. Cat, okay orcs are children of elves and goblins sorry is a cat orcs are children of elves and goblins 
And elves celebrate when their parents bang. All right. All right. My first thought is because the first two are so short. I, like I feel like those could be real, and the third one is like mm-hmm. some fan fictiony thing that you've read <laughs> off of something. This is on Tumblr post I found. Yeah, but uh, the cat thing sounds well. Like, do you mean like like a cat or like a cat like like a literal cat? He was originally a magical cat. Okay. The token was famous for doing like self inserts, or he wasn't famous for, but that he, his self insert was he wanted to be the elves because he originally built the elves to be like these, like this perfect, like back in the day when he wrote Elvish, because he wrote the languages before he wrote the books. Right. Um, uh, that uh, uh, that is true. Uh, that uh, so um, he this elves were like his ideal humans, kind of. Interesting. Okay. So he like wrote yeah. Okay, okay, then elves celebrate conception instead of birthday. I could see that. I could see all of these. They're all the only one I want not to be true is the orcs one. <laughs> That's just gross. Uh you know what? I'm gonna say I'm gonna say the cat one. I'm gonna say it was originally something else but not a cat. <laughs> I got you. It was the orc one. The orc so one was false. There, was I right? And I made that up from scratch. No, oh, you made that, that up. I was sitting oh, here and I was like, I, I found the elves can celebrate Ew. conception thing, and I was like, wow. Because I was like, wait, because do you remember in the second movie or something? They're like pulling orcs out of the vats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These gross vats. So I was like, I'm gonna go off that and like get some lore behind that. Yeah, that's gross. Orcs are orcs are tortured elves. Oh, that, okay. like, way back in the day, Sauron cop captured, or it might have been the guy before Sauron. And they've been ruined. Um, yeah, you can breed them, but like, yeah, they're 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 elves. That's why they're badasses. That's fuck. disgusting. Just because they're they're like gross, evil, tortured elves. That's yeah. so gross. I think they do kind of grow them from like a vat of liquid, though, which is gross. Right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But... yeah. I remember it being all yeah, really wet looking. Uh-huh. Not. <laughs> I can't believe I caught you with that one. Okay, yeah, I, I wanted to get you with one of them. I, I like, almost had it that as was I was my... writing these. I was like, "Oh fuck!" Because yeah. the first two, they were like, you, they kind of felt like facts, and the third one was like something like, "Oh, this is fucked up. I'm gonna choose this one." I didn't know you wrote it though. Yeah, it's no, I close just enough that. that it could be real. That's funny and gross. That is gross. It's one of those things where it's a bit gross, and you're like. Oh, but like he he would have done that to be like an edgy author and be like, I'm going to yeah. put all this logic into it. And it wasn't quite like too far, like messed up where I was like, okay, someone just if it was made like, that up. Uh, goblins blow living elves and, and there's like an elf town that likes to get goblin blown up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's not, that, that would really be a good one. Wait, I'm going to change it to goblin blowjobs and no. see if I can get the guys with it next time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Next, do you want? Actually, I'll, I'll just, I'm just going to give you one. I'm going to give you a Sonic one. Oh All shit! Right? This one's simple. for context. I know nothing about Sonic for anyone mm-hmm. that's listening. I know I've maybe an hour of Sonic stuff in my entire life. I've consumed, and that was probably a video on fucking speed running. You know. <laughs> so this one, you'll. Yeah. Uh, I hope this one with this one, uh, you got a chance of getting. I'm just going to list off. It's simple. Three Sonic characters. And you have to tell me which one's not a Sonic character. Oh, no. Okay. All right. We have Ray the Flying Squirrel, Lou the Lizard, and oh. Charmy B. Oh, shit. Two of them are Sonic characters, and one is not. Oh, God. Okay, right off the bat, my first instinct is I'm going to pick the one I couldn't deal with losing to. As in, if I picked one of the other ones, and you're like, like it, like I'm probably gonna pick Charmy B because if I pick one of the other ones, and you're like Charmy B is the lie. I'm gonna be mad, okay? Because <laughs> I'm gonna be like, God damn it, that's so stupid. Like Ray the Flying Squirrel, there's like a flying fucking fox. Okay, mm-hmm. Lao the Lizard. I don't, I, I don't remember seeing any like lizards. They're all like fucking furries. Mm-hmm. And then Charmy B sounds like a Care Bear, right? <laughs> Charmy B, but it's like a nickname. Like, like they some of them had nicknames like Knuckles. You can see like Charmy. Maybe there's a Charmy A and a Charmy B, and they're twins. It is spelled B E E. 
Okay, okay. That makes more sense because I was like, yeah, like a, I was yeah. thinking twins, but I don't think that's I don't think that's increased or decreased the chances yeah. <laughs> that I get to pick that one. By the way, if it was Charmy A, I would be like, they're twins. I was about to like right. convince myself that there's an A and a B. It's, um, the flying squirrel. The problem with that one is I know there's a dumb kids comic about a flying <laughs> squirrel. I was like a I'll... Superman. All of these, I, I looked up a list of Sonic characters and I picked ones that even I didn't know. <laughs> wow, the lizard. I feel like Charmy B sticks out and I'd be crushed if I lose to it. So I'm going to pick Charmy B. I have to pick Charmy B. Charmy B. Charmy B is a Sonic character. Oh, no. Oh, B like the bug. Fuck. Yeah. I just figured that out. <laughs> I told you, oh, B. Oh, no. Yeah, I know you told me. You told me. But I was. If it was Charmy the B, I would have been less confused because mm. i had them written down as ray the flying so i'm like okay there's a, there's a there's a way they name get right, right 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 so which one's the fake one this is the flying uh, squirrel nope lou the lizard is it's, just why oh, i just okay i had no I chance i had no chance if i didn't think it was charmy i was going with the stupid fucking squirrel oh yeah yeah. lou the lizard was fake lou the lizard oh i was... even said early on i don't think there was ever a lizard i don't remember seeing i think a lizard. there is some lizardy oh is there maybe Fuck. i don't like I a don't dragon know. or something yeah okay that'd be a kari question yeah god damn it all right that's 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 uh, uh you got one you, do you want to go again because you have a lot or do you sure. want me to just go i'll go again all right this one yeah. i think you can probably get uh this is mass effect you played some mass effect right if all, all enough them. to i played like half of two and a little bit of three all right so i'm just gonna list you three alien races oh no of mass effect all right but I, I don't know. I don't know it well enough. If I picked like yeah, popular okay. ones, we're gonna be like, oh, that's like the main. Oh, I, I, it, I, the Mass Effect races I know are human. Okay, I almost put human in there as one. But... <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would be good because maybe it's like they're, they're not technically not the, yeah. they're the Idralites. Yeah, 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 and they're not human. Oh, right. fuck! That would have pissed me off. <laughs> Three alien races in Mass Effect. Number one, Othos. Number two, Elcor. Um, and number three, Rachni. Oh. The problem is okay, instantly, great name. Uh, Rachni is Ratchet and Clank. Elcor is an elf joke. And Othos, the problem with Othos is I'm pretty sure that's one of Colton's nicknames somewhere. On like Steam or some shit, uh... but I don't think you knew that. <laughs> so I don't know if that makes it true or false. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna eliminate that as a real one because Colton likes Mass Effect. Elcor, I'm just gonna gut. I'm gonna rip it, rip it, and crit I think Ratchney's fake. All right, Ratchney is a real. Fuck. Mass Effect race. So is Elcor, and I made up Othos. Oh, that's literally a... <laughs> you got so lucky, you piece of shit. Uh, like, what... Oh, Othos is fucking Colton's. Uh, I knew it was close, but uh, I didn't want to. Sh yeah. Shit. I was gonna Google Othos. Okay, no. Yeah, let's... Wouldn't it be awkward to make something up when you're like, oh, now it's yeah, yeah. real. I, think... <laughs> I had to check some of the yeah. lines. All right. There you go. I'm, I'm two, two, one. I gotcha. Yeah. Uh, how many? Is do it you have? two, one? I got you one. No, I, I got the first one with the brothers. I got that right. All oh, right. So it's one, one. I only have this one more. So I'll go again. Okay. Yes. Um. Or if yours, okay. like, I, I might are quick again, so I could just go through mine, and then we could end with yours if it's another. Oh one sure, one. yeah. Let's just say because uh, mine are all quick like that. I mean, mine. Do you have a really good one? Because mine. Oh no, mine's uh, good. Mine's good. Okay, okay. I'll stand by. Go for it. Uh, okay, Control. You know the game me and Carly like? Control. Oh, no. Okay, the Alan Wake world. Yes, go. Yep. All right, so uh, like kind of like the generic bad guys that are floating around. It's called the Hiss. They kind of, uh, they're all floating around, and they, right, they're so all... It's going to be like the Hiss is actually something else in the game. No, no, no. It's the, the Hiss is a hostile paranatural force that invaded the oldest house, which is the, the building of the Federal Bureau right. of Control where the game takes place. And they're always like kind of just floating around. They're always chanting things. It's Kari spammed in our chat sometimes. Their whole list of things they could say. 
So I'm just going to read oh, three you, lines. Why are you doing that one if it's the one Kari talks about? <laughs> oh, no. Because it's the actual mm. one is all gibberish and weird things. So I'm just going to list you three lines <sighs> from like their whole Oh, it's the chant. lines that I have to guess. I was thinking whether or not they were real. So I was like, no, no, what no, you're no, talking no. about? I thought you were playing some crazy 40 chess because you brought up Kari. I was like, oh, my God, is he trying to no. really? <laughs> okay, go for it. All right. So these are just three separate lines that they say sure. in the game sometimes all together sometimes separate all right an earworm is a tune you can't stop humming in a dream we build you till nothing remains listen to the silence when it shines loud we build you till nothing remains mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Till it shines. So an earworm is a turn you listen to in your a tune you listen to in yeah. your sleep. An earworm is a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. I can't stop humming in a dream. We build you till nothing remains, and listen to the silence when it shines loud. I think I might get you on this one. Okay. An earworm is a tune that you can't stop humming in a dream. I think Kari said in chat once. Okay. So, or something about an ear. That sounds like something I'm pretty sure Kari said in chat. Right. We build you till nothing remains is like, okay, a bit stupid. Mm -hmm. But the problem is, and where I got you, <laughs> is listen to the silence till it shines loud is the same logic as build you till nothing remains. As in, we build you till nothing remains. It's building till nothing remains. That doesn't make sense. It's an illogical sentence. The next one, listens to the silence till it shines loud, is also like an opposite. and doesn't make any sense. You wouldn't listen to something that's shining and then right. loud is dumb. So I'm going to listen to the silence till it shines loud. That is correct. That is not yeah. something they say. <laughs> <laughs> Was my logic correct? <laughs> Uh, probably I didn't like do that on purpose, but that's probably why when I tried to. Think I mean, of something. If you had put the if you'd done them in a different order, I wouldn't have got. Mm, mm -hmm, <laughs> mm. I was like, it's one of these. The earworm. I fucking remember Kari saying some yeah, shit yeah, yeah. about an earworm. That was like the I was just like I could when I heard it, I was like, that's either it, that's either true or that's a lyric from uh somebody's the fucking. What's that artist Kari likes and always shit on? Tyler the Creator. It's either no. <laughs> it's either in the game or it's fake in a Tyler lyric. But I was like, I don't think it's a Tyler lyric. Yeah. All right. Do you want? Or do I just have one left? I might just have one left. Control Mass Effect Brewing. All right, I got one left. Do it. All right. These are just three Mario facts. Oh okay. shit. Three Mario facts. All right. The bricks you smash are actually things. That are toads that Bowser turned into bricks, so you're killing a toad every time you smash a brick. <laughs> Mario is named after a real estate developer, and Mario's last name is Bro. Yeah, I might have you on this one too. Oh, yeah. But I'm not sure because the last one's so stupid and the first one is these are all really stupid. Mm -hmm. The least stupid one is the real estate dev, but I'm pretty sure he was named after their plumber. I'm pretty sure he was named after a guy in the building. Like their 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 maintenance worker or something. Like in the office. Mm. But that might be being like Mario's a plumber. <laughs> <laughs> so bricks you smash are really toads. They turn into bricks. So you're, but you said so you're actually killing toads. That implies that he turns them into bricks. But they're still alive, which is so funny. There's no way that's true. Mario's last name is. Br How can two of these be real? Two of them are real. Okay, I feel like Mario's a real estate dev, even though I think that might be it. Because of the, that's like the only thing I was thinking about. Before you said anything, and I was like, I know Mario is like really... Is it named after or is the real estate dev? What is it? Named after. Oh, shit. 
So I'm wondering if he, he they based it on the guy, but they named it on somebody else. The thing is, that's the one that I'm like, that okay. But last name is Bro is a bit stupider, and the Bricks one is so stupid. <laughs> Am I okay with losing to Toads or Bricks? That's essentially what I'm asking myself. Here. Am I okay <laughs> with somebody being like, you thought that was... Like, if somebody's like, you thought that was real, which one am I okay with them? I'm going to say... I'm going to... Oh, I really want to do the real estate one. The bro, I'm like, okay, maybe. I don't know. But the bricks you smash. <sighs> I'm going to say the bricks one is fake. The bricks one is real. At least in the original mm -hmm. Mario Bros. game. It says that oh. Bowser turned toads into bricks. <laughs> that is... <laughs> So dumb. So it's the <laughs> real estate one, right? Uh, no, that's Mario's last name. Mario does not have a last name. Uh, oh my god. Oh, I would have never. Okay, I feel less bad. If it had been the real estate one, I'd been like, I should have followed my gut. I had no chance. Yeah, I, I would have assumed a plumber too. I just when I was looking up, trying to find weird Mario facts. Apparently, it was uh, uh, oh, okay. a na man named Mario Siegel left an impression oppression on his Nintendo tenants when he stormed into their office demanding late rent. Oh, that's fun. So it was something to do with the building. That's maybe why I was like... Hmm. Yeah. What am I, like, one, one to three or something? I got the Ronnie yeah. one, and that's it, I think. Oh, I got the... Yeah. the okay, oh, I'm like two, two for two on yours. One, two, okay. three, four, five. I got... Oh, I got you on the Mass Effect one, too, yeah. One, two, three, so two, four. Three. Oh, okay, so I'm two to three. Okay, okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that. That's better oh, than yeah. a. That's only a little bit better than thirty four percent. Thirty three percent, I think, is me getting one. No, that's like kind of within the range. I'm a little. I'm, I'm okay. I'm slightly better than average. Oh wow, two to three. That's awful. Okay, <laughs> that's pretty bad. Okay. Well, you can so, get me for two to two. That's that's uh, you know. Yeah, I was. Uh, uh, yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay, I would never have that Mario one. I can't believe that. Um, this is Warhammer. This is Warhammer. So, All right, hit me. Um, arguably the strongest. I'm gonna do short titles, and then you can ask questions. Okay. And some of this, some of them, I'm going to have to look at a Wikipedia page, and then obviously some of them, one of them, I won't. But I have for that one, I have a whole bunch of notes. So you're gonna see okay. me constantly reading. But okay. it's fun. I think it's fun if you get to ask a bunch of questions. Sure. Um, because I could, so, like, I'm going to give you, like, the punchline. Otherwise, um, each one of these is going to be 10 minutes. Uh, right. Okay. So, arguably the strongest orc in the universe is named after a uh, controversial British prime minister. Um, okay. Uh, the main um, land raiders. Or like uh, a, a tank. They look like a World War One tank it's with the treads that go all the way around. Kind yep, of. Yep. Actually, I can just. This is what a land raider is. It looks like a World War One tank. Land raiders yeah. are not, and land speeders. I think that might be a land speeder, um, which are, is like a similar version, but it's like a lighter, like okay. light armor that goes fast. Um, yep. Are not named after the fact that they go over land. But they're named after the fact that they were founded by a guy called Arkin Land. Okay. And um, the third one is uh, elf poop uh, in certain sectors um, is used to get high by nobles, noble humans. Okay. Sectors are groups of planets, gotcha. are groups of stars nearby. Okay. Well, kind of nearby. Kind of. That's complicated. Okay. That's not getting. Let's pretend they're nearby. Okay. That's, all, that's so another I, forty minute conversation. I can ask questions now. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Go. For can it. I ask what the the prime minister's name was? What the name? Uh, her name is Margaret Thatcher. <laughs> okay. If, if Margaret Thatcher and, was so a you're saying very after, controversial. Yeah, yeah. The the orc's um, not named Margaret so Thatcher. The, so, but the, it's like... so the orc's name is Grazkol Marg Uruk Thraka. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. People call him in it normally it's shortened to Grazkol Thraka. Okay. Okay. And then the, the land people raiders call him one, Grazkol. It's that they're they're 
named after the guy that made them, which is I just wrote down Mr. Yeah, Lan- found Mr. So uh, okay. there were like ten thousand years where fucking all the planets got cut off and pretty much all tech was lost. So there's a big thing now where they're finding what's called an FPC, which is like a storage of how they make things. Because okay. things and it's like it's a three D printer file, right? And the SDCs can make things. So he's the guy that refound. Um, gotcha. Gotcha. This like grind tank. Thing. Okay. But, yeah. but it's not named after the fact that it's a fucking, you know, like a thing that goes along the land and breaks. Right. It's because it's his last name. Right. Okay. And then remember, the elf... a writer wrote this, just, yeah. just so we're clear. And then elf poop. How? Elf poop. How? Are they getting, are they just sniffing it? Are they smoking it? So they melt it down uh, in liquid and they, and they like sift all the, the bits out and they use the liquid as like a tea that they drink mm. and then they have hallucinations. It's um, like they're mushrooms. It's like, yeah, mushrooms. it's compared to like mushrooms. It's not like cocaine or anything, but it's like uh-huh. a hallucinogenic happy time. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, the one, the one that sounds least suspicious is the land. That's uh, the least suspicious. Okay, okay. That just because that one's kind of like, or it kind of makes sense. The other two are kind of like, the 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 name after the prime minister one. Like, I feel like it could be a different prime minister, or I could feel like it's just people think that it sounds similar to, uh, what was it, Margaret Thatcher? It, I, uh, yeah, okay, okay. Or then elf poop. Just sounds ridiculous, but <laughs> there's there a story are... about a space marine having sex with a centaur. Um, that one's true. Uh, that is a hundred percent true. And he has sex with a centaur, falls in love. Like forty k is stupid. Okay. I the go... reason that's really stupid is because the whole purpose of space marine is to like kill things that are non-human. So it's a little ridiculous right. one of them fell in love with a centaur i'm gonna go the orc. You, no more questions You're just going for it uh, no i'm gonna say the orc one is fake oh i got you again it's Damn the it. elf poop one i was gonna say that but again it was i so... wrote so much for the elf poop i was Did ready you? for questions i wrote the entire backstory yeah i stole the idea from somebody on on the internet mm. uh, mm. yeah i had a whole thing and i was just like Shit, I don't have this because the the other long one in Lord of the Rings was the fake one, right? So I was about to do that and then be like, "Oh, oh. and tell you a fucking paragraph Lord. and a half." So I was like, "Oh shit, good lord!" No, yeah, yeah Grasko Mog Uruk Thaka it was. Uh, they used to name character. They did a lot of that shit back in like the nineties and eighties yeah. when it was starting out. They would do like really little. I was hoping yeah. it'd be like you, like a technicality thing where it was a different prime minister or uh, <laughs> it wasn't an orc or something. It was like <laughs> yeah. And then also when you said it too, it looked like you kind of like uh, you just kind of made up a name. Oh, okay. I just so, yeah. went for it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it fucking up. I mean, it's spelled like I'll, put, I'll yeah. I was gonna send this to you, and I'll, I'm gonna make you're gonna think that's Nick true because it's capitalist. Okay, it's spelled Mag Uruk Thraka. It's pretty gotcha. good. Um, jeez, well, that was fun. That was good. Yeah. That was a lot of fun. I would love to have Colton and Kari. It, come it would in. be fun for us to do that again with everybody because everybody will have very different ones, especially Kari. Kari's gonna Col- have some yeah, yeah, Undertale yeah. ones or something. Kari's gonna have some shit, some Hollow yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit, and they're all yeah. gonna be. It's gonna be. You know, when you whenever whenever I watch a video or somebody's playing two truths one lie, mm-hmm. and they start with something like "I slept with your girlfriend," and it's like oh. it has to be the lie, right? And yeah. then the next one is like, like I kidnapped a child, and you're like, like "Oh what no, what is going on?" <laughs> yeah. And that's gonna be Kari for real. Yeah. Well, but let was... us know if you you like this episode. If you want to see some more of like this, we had fun. We'd do it again. So yeah, yeah, that Thanks was for awesome. Listening, and uh, we'll see you next week. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah,